Osteoarthritis of the knee can be painful and prevent you from enjoying the things you like to do. According to the American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons, more than 15 million people in the United States suffer from osteoarthritis of the knee. Of these 15 million people, there is a large portion of the population diagnosed with early to mid-stage osteoarthritis, like Marjorie. Depending on where the arthritis is located in your knee, macoplasty partial knee resurfacing may be right for you. The knee is made up of three compartments, the medial, lateral, and patellofemoral. Osteoarthritis typically begins in the medial compartment or on the inner side of the knee. Nice to meet you. During the early stages, you may have to limit some daily activities. You are usually able to pinpoint exactly where the pain is located simply by pointing to it. If pain persists, the physician can inject the site with a corticosteroid to reduce inflammation and manage pain or prescribe anti-inflammatory medication. But as the disease and pain progress, these treatment options may no longer be effective. During early to mid-stage osteoarthritis, macoplasty, a minimally invasive partial knee arthroplasty, could be a successful treatment option. During macoplasty, the diseased portion of the knee joint is removed and healthy bone stock and tissue are spared. Once the disease progresses into the patellofemoral compartment of the knee, partial resurfacing of both the medial and patellofemoral joints may be an option. Otherwise, your only surgical option is total knee arthroplasty, during which large amounts of healthy tissue and bone must be removed along with the diseased portions, and this can result in a significantly longer recovery time following surgery. Today there is new hope for adults living with early to mid-stage osteoarthritis. There's macoplasty. Macoplasty is a minimally invasive procedure that's enabled by a robotic arm system that assists the surgeon in achieving optimal resurfacing and placement of the implant. Each procedure begins with a pre-surgical CT scan of the patient's knee. This information is then digitally scanned into the MAKO system for the surgeon to use in making a custom pre-surgical plan. This plan details every step of bone preparation, resurfacing, and implant positioning during surgery. This careful planning facilitates the most accurate positioning and precise alignment of the implant possible. During macoplasty, the bone is minimally resurfaced, saving valuable bone stock and sparing tissue. The pinpoint precision and consistency afforded by the robotic arm system that assists the surgeon during the procedure provides a more natural feeling and functioning knee following surgery. Because macoplasty facilitates more precise placement of the implant and spares healthy bone and tissue, macoplasty patients may experience a more rapid recovery and return to normal activities than with traditional knee surgery. Marjorie left the hospital only 72 hours after her surgery and returned to normal activities shortly thereafter. In some cases, you may go home even earlier or in the same day if you undergo macoplasty in an outpatient facility. For many, like Marjorie, the answer is macoplasty, partial knee resurfacing. Ask your doctor if macoplasty is right for you. Macoplasty is not ideal for all patients. Only your doctor can determine which orthopedic treatments are available to you and recommend the ideal treatment in light of your particular condition and symptoms. Mako Surgical, restoring quality of life through innovation.